Hello, uh, Dr. Malinsky, are you there? We've been trying to get in touch with you. Are you there? Is this working? Dr. Malinsky, here we are on page one of the Google results when you search your own name. How is that possible? How did we get above all of your content? It's because we make it happen that way. But the we question do. is, how is your ideal patient going to find you? What are they saying about you online? And what if you could control everything on this page, maybe even several pages deep? That's what we'd like to talk to you about in this video. Suggestion, keep watching. We're going to have Dr. Mark go through some of the things that we do. Here it comes. Hi, this is Dr. Mark Kosman. If you're not successfully using the internet to market your dental practice, this might be the most important video you can watch right now. It doesn't matter whether your practice is local, regional, or nationwide. It doesn't even matter if your practice is currently doing anything online. If you don't understand how to take advantage of this new marketing platform, many of your prospective patients and referral sources will not find you. They will not hear about you, and they will not become a part of your practice you literally cannot afford to ignore what's going on any longer. Over the next couple of minutes, you'll understand exactly what you can do right now to get found online, engage with more patients and prospective patients, convert more of them into active patients, and then turn them into raving fans with no extra work on your part. Whether you want it or not, you have an online presence right now. The question is, who's creating your online reputation? There are nearly a hundred websites collecting information about you and your practice, and they're creating profiles for all to see. What's being said about you right now? And is that reflecting an accurate image of you? If you don't actively take charge of building your online reputation, somebody else will, and you may not like the picture that they are painting of you. Now, you know how many dental practice there are, practices there are all around you in this area. What is it that's going to make your practice leap off the page of online search results? How are you going to not just stand out of the crowd, but get out of the crowd altogether? Do you currently dominate your competition online? Your patients, your future patients, they've moved online. If you don't create a presence where they're spending time, how are you going to remain visible and relevant to them? They've all kind of gone off on this journey into the world of social media. Are you going to join them there or will you simply fade from view? And when you do make that initial connection, how will you follow up over time? Are you really going to rely on good intention and faulty memory? Because the truth is there's simply no way to keep track of and effectively follow up with all patients and prospects without relying on automated systems. Now, if you don't have all of these critical components working for you in your practice right now, we simply have to ask why not? You know that everything has changed because of technology and the internet, and the pace of that change continues to accelerate. It used to be that you could put an ad in the yellow pages or in the local newspaper, and the patients, they would just come. But the truth is, Everything is fragmented now into multiple little channels of communication and people want it to be interactive. They want to, inter they want to participate in a conversation with you. So more often than not, if you're broadcasting a message, it falls on deaf ears. So clearly it's the internet that has changed everything. People, they don't need to wait for information to come to them any longer through their mailbox or anything else. When they've got a problem, they go online and they find their own answers. Now, we know that the vast majority of people, they've become very proactive at finding what they want because it's all right there at their fingertips. They just need the keyboard. But with all of the information on the web, people face a new problem. Whom should they believe? Now, especially when it comes to healthcare, there are so many fragmented, incomplete, and inaccurate profiles about you right now online that it's hard for your patients to get a clear picture. In the end, if they're feeling overwhelmed, people are going to make a decision based on what they actually think is objective information. And that's why you have to be really concerned about all of these online review sites. The majority of people, they're telling us clearly that they're much more influenced by what other people are saying about you, more so than anything you can say about yourself. What that means is, if you're spending money on advertising the old school way, much of that money is simply going up in smoke. And yes, 98% of dentists, they tell us, hey, I rely on word of mouth. And what that says to us is that they're not really actively marketing at all. They're, 
they're hoping, they're hoping that their patients are going to take the initiative and bring family and friends into the practice. And while word of mouth is always going to be critical, even that has moved online. So you need to be an active participant in the conversation here if you hope to remain relevant and visible. Now, how big a conversation are we talking about? Well, this number represents only the active number of Facebook users, not the total number of accounts. And then there are all the other social media sites that you have to take into consideration. And you might wonder, what are all these people talking about with each other online? Well, they're sharing experiences about everything. And yes, that includes dentistry and all of healthcare. So you need them to be including you in this conversation that they're having. Now, if you think that Facebook is just for kids, you're going to miss out on the person who's really directing much of the traffic to your practice. Guess who makes up the fastest growing group on social media? Well, I'll give you a hint. She's the one making most of the appointments for the family for your practice. And the question is, is this a group that's relevant to the health of your practice? Yeah, I think so. So this is where your patients have gone. This is where your prospective patients are searching for solutions to problems the moment they arise. And if you're not here to meet them right at that moment, then you are simply invisible. Now, that's why your online presence is really now the key to building a practice that's not just going to survive, but one that truly thrives. You need to build a path, a, a series of experiences from the moment of the first encounter through a process of building trust and credibility, and then finally bringing them across the threshold of your practice, a ready partner in your healthcare process. The question is, are you already too late? Have you missed the boat as your competitors crowd you out of visibility online? Well, the truth is you may well be too late, but here is what we do know. Only about a quarter of businesses have done what it really takes to make effective use of the web and far fewer dental practices have done so. But these alarm bells, they're sounding right now and this situation is changing very rapidly. Okay, so what exactly do you need to do to become the dominant force in your expert niche and in your geographic area of practice? Well, you need to achieve three strategic outcomes. You need to get found online. You need to engage with your audience of ideal patients. And then you need automated systems that follow up and follow up and then follow up some more to bring people to your practice already knowing, liking, and trusting you. So what is it that you really need to do right now? Well, this first step may sound obvious, but it's actually what stops 96% of dental practices right in their tracks. If you never get out of the starting gate, it is pretty hard to reach your destination. But that alone is not going to guarantee you real success. There are a lot of moving parts to an effective online marketing strategy. And you need the whole to be much greater than the sum of any of the little individual parts. But you also can't afford to step away from your practice and build all of this yourself. You are the primary income generator. If you get distracted, your income will fall off. I am never going to take the time to learn how to drill and fill my own teeth. Hell, I'm not even going to take the time to learn how to change the oil in my car. You need to focus on your strengths and then you need to outsource for maximum efficiency and results just like any other business does. And this is where we can play a key role for you. We can do all of this for you or we can provide you and your staff with a plan and the coaching to implement that plan yourself over time or we can simply create the plan and leave you on the do-it-yourself path. The choice is yours. But no matter which option you choose, we're going to begin pretty much the same way that you begin when a new patient comes through your doors. First, we need to assess the health of your online presence. You might begin by taking some x-rays or running some other tests with that, with that new patient, but we're going to do pretty much the same for you. And then, much the way you would review those results and make recommendations and a treatment plan, we can pinpoint the highest priority actions to improve your online presence. And while you might be looking for cavities, we're looking for the critical gaps that are holding you back right now. And then, we're going to take a detailed look at what people are actually saying about you right now online because there's really not much point in building an elaborate marketing system on a damaged foundation. So first, we must assess. 
Normally, we charge $297 for our clients to run this assess phase practice analysis. But right now, we're offering you this service at no charge at all. We're doing this because we've already spent time looking at your practice and we believe you need to see what we're seeing right now. Are you ready to take the first step toward becoming a dental top doc legend? Well, your first step is not only free, it's extremely simple. Just go to dentaltopdoclegends.com slash assess and you'll find a simple form to complete. Provide us with basic information about your practice and we'll run a detailed analysis and assessment. And then we'll get back to you with the results because you really do need to see exactly what we're seeing right now. So just head over to dentaltopdoclegends.com forward slash assess and fill in that form right now. If you're quick enough, you're going to discover that we have a hidden bonus right there on the form. We look forward to reviewing your results with you from this practice analysis very soon. Wow, Dr. Mark, you really covered a lot of stuff there very, very quickly. We did, but there we have a ton more information for people to get. Yes, there is a lot more information. So we want to give you the assess so you see what is going on there online about you. So what do you need to do? Just click that, that button, button down right below. There. Just in the same way that a new patient walking in your door, you're going to do some x-rays, do a little bit of an, an assessment of uh, where things stand. We're giving that. We normally charge $297 to our clients. We want to give it to you because we've been trying to get through to you, get your attention here. So delay no longer. Click that button right now. Fill in Go some fill information. Go a little bit of information and get that assess done for you right now. It's free just for you.